something weird is happening in Santo Alesa. I'm telling you now, I've played a lot of open world crime games, and I've never seen so many links towards this one thing in a game before that's not based around the actual concept of it. So, first of all, there are a lot of UFOs um, in the map. Now, obviously, you can put this down to Easter eggs, and they are. They're obviously just small little Easter eggs that are meant to be funny. You know, there's not like there's any real lore behind them or anything. But what if there is? I mean, one of the Easter eggs has a big pillar of floating rocks that you have to follow instructions from. Who did that? Why is it there? So I settled on it and thought hey, maybe it's just an elaborate Easter egg with no meaning. And hey, it might still be that. But now I found yet another uh, weird pillar, which is um, a photograph you have to take in the game for the collectibles. Um, I can't quite remember the name, but it's on screen for you. Um, and it's weird, it, it's supernatural, it's not normal for this map. And it's really leading me to think that there might be quite a few strange things in Santo Aliso happening. Um, I suppose that's why we have the Keep It Strange tagline. <laughs> but it's really weird, I mean, aliens seem to just have this crazy theme throughout the game. And I know that's silly saying that when Saint Row 4 was our last game, but for a game like this, it's quite abnormal. Like, I understand that Saint Row's never been very uh, realistic, but we've had UFOs previously in the game as like a, a vehicle and stuff like in Saint Row 2, but with this is like unreal, like the theme is just scattered throughout the game. I love it, but it's quite clear there's quite a few supernatural things happening, so I want to just wonder with you guys here, I want to just think and theorise. Do you think that Santo Aliso has got some sort of hidden supernatural alien past? Do you think there's that sort of depth in the game where there's actually some hidden backstory to all the aliens and all the supernatural things happening? Because, you know, one UFO, it's an easter egg. Two UFOs, it's a quite heavily uh, forced upon you easter egg. Three UFOs, a floating pillow of rocks and a sort of weird stone that glows um, in the middle of the map, in the middle of nowhere. It's hard for me to think that these are just throwaway easter eggs because so much effort has been put into them. It makes you wonder if something's going on in Santo Aliso. I also have another thing I want to bring up, and this is something that has been bothering me like crazy. Around the map, there are these doors. And I call them doors because they're just a simple painting, it's just an arch with a road and a blue sky the road's leading to. But it's confusing me. There's lots of them, and they're all in very specific locations. So there's one by the UFO, I'll show that on screen now. I'm like, whoa, this is crazy. There's one by the Panther Rock, and there's a few more I have seen around um, Santa Elisa that I can't quite remember. But they're scattered around, and it seems quite interesting with the locations they're at. I think there's possibly more to this, but I don't quite have the evidence to back it up yet. So, if you're playing Saints Row, and you come across any of these doors, screenshot them, send them in the Discord. See what's going on. Look into them, investigate them. Who knows what they are? I want to know all the locations um, to find these things. It's it's really interesting to me um, the way this works. And I'm quite curious at how this is going to go. So, let me know. Have you seen any sort of weird things? I mean, there's a few obvious easter eggs like the comb and the dancing bush. But I mean, there's a lot of like weird supernatural stuff going on. And I'm quite curious about it. So, keep an eye out. Take a look around Santa Elisa. Let me know if you spot anything. Thank you for watching. I hope you did enjoy.